as measured by Consumer Price Index at Uganda Bureau of Statistics, the rate at which commodity prices are increasing has reduced. Now, if you look at the headline inflation, they're saying it has reduced to 3.9 up from 4.9 percent, and the head-to-head -head, that's monthly inflation has also reduced uh, to 0, 0.0 up from 0 0.3 recorded in the month of June. Production is high. Of course, automatically the forces of demand and supply, the prices will be low. So that one, is, we are seeing that most of these items have started to come in. Members, a bunch of matoke. How much money were you buying a bunch of matoke in March? All of you know that a bunch of matoke in March, Feb, it was way too high. But currently, you, the bunch of matoke actually has gone down. So when we are doing these measurements, we are also trying to ask, but at the same time they tell you there is a lot of matoka and you can even see it in the centers where you are buying. So that one is very important. The main drivers that lead to a decrease in monthly inflation was the monthly food crops and related items inflation that decreased by 3.1% in July 2023, up from 4.2% drop recorded in June 2023. This was mainly due to monthly vegetables, cooking bananas and pulse inflations. Specifically, cooking bananas inflation decreased by 17.6% in July 2023, up from 20.0 drop recorded in June 2023. Rice inflation as well registered at 24.6% in July 2023 compared to 3 compared to 31.7% recorded in June 2023. According to records, they are saying that food crops and related items, they are the ones whose inflation has reduced to a normal price. But according to experts, they are saying that the country is coming back to normal from the COVID-19 pandemic shock. Speaking to some of the traders from Nakao market, they say that the price of rice hasn't yet reduced to their expectations. They said that they used to buy a sack of rice that is equivalent to 100 kgs at 550,000, but now is at 520,000. The price of rice has not reduced very well. We used to buy a sack of 100 kilograms at 550,000. They have just reduced it by 20,000 Uganda shillings. A box of tomatoes is around 80,000, so you sell carefully to get profits. Green pepper is not that expensive too. There was an increase in the prices of commodities and housing, water, electricity, gas, whose inflation was recorded at 3.2% in their ending July 2023, compared to 0.8% compared in the year June 2023. When we talk about slowing down in the inflation, we might think that everything has reduced, but we have those checks in other categories, the COICOP divisions, the 13 that we normally compile our index and the inflation. You realize that when you look at the clothing and footwear on an annual basis, if you try to compare the last year, that is the year that we had the 12 months up to June 2023, we registered the clothing and footwear inflation at 3.1 percent but when this year that is ending july it is at 3.4 percent meaning there are some items that have actually gone up because when you try to look at the annual basis most of the inflation has either stayed the same or it has slowed down much as other products have recorded a decrease in prices, there are other products that have recorded a rise in prices, especially charcoal. And this follows the presidential ban on charcoal burning and exportation outside the country. Pedson Mumbere, Smart 24 TV, Business Today.